Hi everyone, this is Tony, your local realtor here in Central Florida. Today I'm here in Story Park, a community by Lennar Homes. So in this community, the starting price is gonna be around your mid 400s. Those are gonna be your townhomes. And it's gonna go all the way up to about your mid 800s for those two story next gen single family homes. In terms of location of this community, you're right off of State Road 528 and also 417, which will pretty much take you anywhere here in Central Florida. You're just about five minutes away from your closest Publix. You're about 10 to 15 minutes off of Narcusi Road, where you can find Walmart, Sam's Club, Aldi's, and Bravo Supermarket, and also plenty of dining options as well. If you guys like to visit the theme parks, Disney World and Universal Studios are only about 35 minutes away. This specific model that I'm standing on right now is called the Harwich 2. It has five bedroom, three and a half bath, and comes in just under 4,000 square feet. This community also does have a HOA fee of $269 per month, which does include two clubhouse with two, two pools and also tennis court, basketball courts for you guys to enjoy. If you guys are interested, let's turn this camera around and take a tour of this beautiful model home. So here we are in front of the Harwich 2 model, two-story home with a three-car tandem garage. You have your beautiful stone elevation right by the entrance here. You will also notice your brick pavers as well. Coming up to your front door, you also do have a covered front porch as well for you to come and relax during the morning or evening. Plenty of landscaping up in the front as well. Now let's step inside. Right when you come in, very nice foyer. If you guys come to the left here, you do have your formal dining table with your coffer ceilings on top. You also do have porcelain tiles all throughout the common areas. Now I'm just gonna give you guys a sneak peek of this butler's pantry that goes to your kitchen. But let's just go back to the foyer. So we can continue straight ahead. Now we open up into your great room and your kitchen. Very spacious open concept. You have your central island with your granite countertops, dishwasher, goose deck, goose neck style faucet. You have your microwave range hood, electrical stove top. These look like 42 inch cabinets with chrome molding. You also have plenty of counter space. Beautiful pendant light fixtures all throughout. Now let me just turn back around into your butler's pantry where you get extra cabinets and counter space. Very nice size pantry. And then the pass through into your formal dining table. Here you have a more casual dining table. This is more like for the family. And then the one up in the front is if you guys have any guests over or for Thanksgiving, Christmas, where you have to host a lot more people in your house. 
You can also turn that into a flex space, so make it into a home office, study. Here is going to be your living room, very spacious as well. It's really nice how everything just opens up in here. Now before we go too far deep in the house, I don't want to miss these over here. This right here is going to be the entrance into your garage. So you guys can see three car tandem. Plenty of space in here. And right next to the garage door, you have some extra counter space. And here is the half bathroom downstairs. Here you have your staircase going up and right next to the staircase, you have your washer and dryer unit stacked. And right next to the laundry room, tucked away in the corner, here you do have your owner suite. Very nice tray ceilings on top as well. Two windows facing the back of the house. And in the corner here. Let me turn on the lights. Here you have your split vanity along with a bathtub right in the middle. To the right, here you have your step-in shower. And right next to the shower, you have the toilet. And to the left, you have a very spacious walk-in closet as well with motion sensor lights. Now let's go check out your outdoor space before we go upstairs. So you do have this outdoor cover lanai, which is also screened in as well. Plenty of space back here. If you wanna grill, entertain, and you do back up to conservation for this specific lot. Now let's go upstairs. You have your beautiful spindles here. Carpet going up. So right when you come up straight ahead, you do have some closet space. Now if I just back up a little, close this, and turn to my left, there you have a hallway along with your upstairs loft. 
and then on the other side of the staircase here you have a couple of doors as well so I'm just gonna show you guys the loft real quick you have plenty of space play tic-tac-toe you have looks like ping-pong your television and right here on the side is going to be your HVAC. So this is definitely a really good size loft. You have plenty of space. So this is the staircase I came off from. Now I'm gonna go left into this hallway. This first door is gonna lead into the second bedroom. Carpet all throughout the second floor. We have a nice size step-in closet. Coming right out, if you keep walking down, the next door is going to be a full bathroom with your double vanity sink. Along with a, there's going to be a door here that leads you into the shower and also the toilet. And at the end of this hallway, you have the third bedroom. Beautiful accent walls by the headboard, two nice windows facing the front. And for this specific room, you do have two closets as well. Now coming out, walking across to the other side. So here was that storage space, storage closet when we first came up the stairs. Now here on the other side, you will find two more rooms with another full bathroom for them to share. Double vanity sinks again, and you will find these porcelain tiles in all the wet areas as well. A separate door that leads you into your shower and your toilet. Here is going to be the fourth bedroom. We have a walk-in closet as well for this room. And last but not least, tucked away right next to the staircase here. Well, before we go in, here is a laundry room. So this is going to be a bigger one compared to the one downstairs. And here is your fifth and final bedroom. And tucked away in the corner. Here you do have a walk-in closet as well. Now I'm just gonna head downstairs again so you guys have a better idea of the layout. But here when you come upstairs, 
remember I was facing this storage closet and then to the left that hallway is going to lead to two rooms with a full bathroom in the middle beautiful loft right upstairs now let's reset to the middle here if I make a right full bathroom fourth bedroom laundry room and then your fifth bedroom now let me just head downstairs so you guys have a better idea of the layout down there So here we are back at the front door, right when we come in, this is the way you're facing, turn left. This is right now staged as a formal dining room with your coffer ceilings, but you can definitely turn this into a study or flex room if you like, but since it does have that butler's pantry that passed through, this would make for a really nice dining room. Now let me just back up. If I just keep walking down, everything just opens up into a huge space. You have your kitchen, center island. The butler's pantry. The actual pantry there. You have your casual dining table living room and on the side there straight ahead you have a half bathroom and then to the right you have the entrance into your garage stairs that go all the way up to the second floor outdoor cover lanai this is going to be a smaller laundry room and then tucked away in the back here you have your owner suite On the side, you have the master bathroom with a double vanity. So if you guys are interested in this specific floor plan or this community or have any questions, feel free to reach out. My number is 954-830-3816. Or if you guys would like to schedule your own walkthrough tour, feel free to reach out. This community is going to sell out by the end of 2024. So if you guys are interested, definitely reach out.